Hello and welcome to the Corpus Linguistics Workshop with Dr. Barami Kiewishai. Today we will look at how to load your corpus into NCONG version 4.1.0. This version allows you to keep your corpus in the corpus library in NCONG. And there are two ways to load your corpus. Open files as a quick corpus and loading your corpus through the corpus manager function. As for the first method, you can click on the file tab on the top left of the screen, then select open files as a quick corpus. Next, you will have to select corpus files. So let's select them. Okay. And click open. Now the software will process the data. And when it is complete, the corpus is created. Okay. Now uh, this version of NCOM can process plain text, Microsoft Words, and even PDF files. Okay, so this method is quite easy to do, but unfortunately with this method, if you load a new corpus, this corpus will disappear. So it is not quite practical if you have many corpora to work on. Now the second way is to through Corpus Manager. Here you can upload and name your corpus. So once you open your Corpus Manager, okay, you have to select raw files, okay, and then add directory or add file. Okay, this is the directory that I'm going to load it. Okay, and then you have to name your corpus. I'm going to name it WHO Species on COVID-19. Okay. And then I'm going to click Create. Now that the corpus is created, okay, you can have information about the description on the right okay and then you can return to the main window okay so here you can see the corpus okay you have the name of the corpus here the number of files and the size of the corpus and now it's ready for use now with this method okay it is quite practical because once you clear all tools and file okay if you open the corpus manager again your corpus will remain here so you can just click on it and then choose it okay so you don't have to uh, keep finding where the files are okay you can just select it from uh, the corpus library in Hong Kong so here is ready for use another thing to note is that there are also pre-built corpora the American English 2006 corpus or the AME 06 and the British English 2006 or BE 06. Okay. You can double click on it. Okay. And there are some sub corpora. Okay. And also the full corpus is this file AME 06.db. Okay. You can click on it. Okay. You can uh, then uh, find the information about this corpus and you can select choose if you want to use the corpus okay if you could return to the main window then the corpus is ready for use I need to emphasize okay that you have to double click on it okay until the files expand to the next level and then you have to again double click on the file that has the extension db okay before you can select choose okay so that's something that we need to keep in mind okay, if we want to use these pre-built corpora okay that's it for this video 
Now you know how to upload your corpus into Ankong version 4.1.0. In my next videos, we will explore how to use other functions. Thank you very much for watching and stay tuned for the next video. Until then, goodbye.